Hey guys, here we have a Roomba 500 series. This particular model is a 560. Uh, we're going to learn how to change a battery properly today on a Roomba. So we're going to start off by flipping this upside down. I took out the brush and beater out of the module right here. Doesn't matter, you could keep yours in if you want. We're going to remove these four screws right here. This one, those two this one by the wheel. Uh, we're not going to fully remove them, just unscrew them enough for them to pop out. The screws do not come out of the cover, because if they do, uh, then your cover is broken. <laughs> Okay, then we will remove the screw from the side brush. Be careful with it, not to lose it, because it's very hard to find a replacement for the screws. Then uh, what we do is we just lift the cover up. We get the battery that is located right here, pull it by the strap, take it off, get another one, get the new one, not just any other one, put it in. You could see that it goes in this way because it has the little, the little bump right there and it goes in pretty well over there. Fits well. Put the cover back. Make sure that it's aligned pretty good. Snaps into place. And then we just screw the screws back in. When we screw them in, uh, you could do them in order, but I prefer to do them in a X style because that kind of makes sure the, the screws are in and the plate goes in uh, evenly. When you're doing this, you could open the cover and uh, get a vacuum and suck out all the extra dust and hair that collects in there because that could that can minimize the life of the Roomba. So put the side brush in, make sure it's popped into place. Put the screw inside. It can be tricky to screw it in sometimes. So we screw it in, but we don't over screw it, not to ruin the threads. Make sure it's tight in there so it won't fly out because if it does, most likely you're going to lose your screw. After we do this, it might not turn on depending on the battery where you get it. Uh, you put it to charge and let it charge for 18 hours straight without unplugging it. Unplugging it may ruin the battery life. It will blink really fast, twice the speed of a regular charge. and That basically means it's power charging and it's it's rebuilding the life of the battery building it back up so just leave it for 18 hours without unplugging it should be good all of that under three minutes roughly